Hey, this is Gothic from the future. I've already recorded the run you're about to see, but we've had some extra special news that I want to let you guys know. The game has a release date. Balatro will release on February 20th on Steam, PlayStation, Nintendo Switch, and Xbox. So get hype. The game will be here in less than a month on your chosen platform. For now, though, here's the video that I had already prepared. Cheers. Hello everybody, welcome back to Balatro. This is the 0.9.2 demo. If this video is live, then you should be able to go and download the new demo right now. The links to the Steam page are in the description down below. You may need to like close Steam entirely and reload it to make sure the new uh, refresh is there for the demo to download, but it's here. You can go and download it right now and I get to play it right now. So play, we have the blue deck plus one hand every round. We have the magic deck. Start with the crystal ball voucher and two copies of the fool and the anaglyph deck. After defeating each boss blind, gain a double tag. All right, we're gonna start with the basics. We're gonna start with blue. We still only have the white stake and this has changed from dailies to challenges. That's absolutely fine. We can still do seeds if we want to, but right now we don't. Let's jump into it. So we can skip for a handy tag, start round with an extra three hands. We don't need that. We've got five hands, three discards, starting with our $4, as is fairly traditional. Show me, oh, I was gonna say show me a king, but I will start with quads quite happily. So because we have an extra hand, we get an extra dollar when we win. And we have our first undiscovered joker. We have two undiscovered jokers, plus 120 chips, if played hand contains a flush, allows straights to be made with gaps of one, with gaps of one rank. Example, two, three, five, seven, eight, misses out four and six. Let's try the straights first. We've got a celestial pack and an arcana pack, but we'll keep our five dollars ready for interest. Next round. So we could do ace, deuce, tray, four, six as a straight, because we have shortcut. It shows straight over on the left. That's very exciting. Uh, seven, six, five, four, three is just a straight in its own right. We need 10 more points. We'll take the full house. Sure thing. Oh, it's so exciting. I did see some of Jimbo's Invitational, but not lots of it. After three rounds, sell this card to duplicate a random Joker. Is incredibly interesting. However, duplicating Shortcut is not useful to me at all. But I would be remiss if we didn't take the rare and try and do something silly in a round or two, right? So after three rounds, the other problem is I currently have no scoring whatsoever and we have to defeat the hook. Uh, we will just start with a full house though and then it's going to discard two random card per hand played. So we're gonna we're gonna have either the nine six or three remaining after this. That's 300 points. Oh look another full house immediately. love to see that. That's one on Invisible Joker. If Poker Hand is a straight flush, create a random spectral card. Could you imagine if I had two of these? God, we're never gonna pull it off. We're never gonna pull it off, but we have to try. Also, I still have no scoring. <laughs> uh, shop has a polychrome Joker. That would be incredible, except I won't be able to do the big blind. I can barely do this small blind. Right, they're not going to randomly discard stuff anymore, which is good. Two pair is not going to score a lot. Let's look for a nine or a four. We did not get it. Let's look for a king or a nine. Still didn't get it. We could do a straight. King, no we can't, because that's only four cards. I don't have four fingers. We 
we are flying way too close to the sun here. 350 points. There's one ace and two tens left in the deck. We did not find them. There are one queen, one ace, two tens, one five. Oh, the queen is not what I need. Flush is going to have to do something for us. I need 45 points. Ace, queen, jack, ten, eight is a straight. Right, after the next round, the invisible joker will pop and duplicate something. Hopefully not shortcut. Uh, we're definitely going to buy credit card because that's going to let us go up to $20 in debt. And that means I can do some shopping. Sell this card to create a free double tag. Gives a copy of the next tag selected. Double tag excluded. Let's buy that. Sell that. Roll. Doubling my money does not help me here. Each face card held in hand gives $1 does not help me here. I need some multiplier game. Any multiplier. Okay. Lusty and gluttonous. We have an exact starting deck so let's go lusty then we sell the credit card we have minus 15 dollars we have a way to get some multiplier and then we hope that seance is the thing that goes off when we get our doubling here Jack, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5 is a straight. Should we try and make a straight flush, though? I think we should. Show me some hearts. King, Queen, Jack, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5. Let's try that. Ace, King, Jack, 10, 9, 8. Come on, we can find a couple more hearts here, can't we? Ace, King, Queen, Jack, 10, 9. It's not quite the one we need. We need the 10 or the 9 of hearts, which are both still in the deck. Come on. One time. We did not get it. We can still play a very big flush. Hopefully this is 1,200 points. Otherwise, I'm completely screwed. It was. This is going to go. After three rounds, sell this card to duplicate a random joker. I don't know why I thought that was going to go off automatically. Okay. That gives us some choice in the matter of things we have no money whatsoever do we sell shortcut to then sell invisible and have a higher chance of getting seance to go or do we just punt now i think we just punt now god damn it <laughs> all right well we might as well test as to see if we can double up this for really really broken straights or not So, Jack, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4. That does not make a straight. So, the double gapper in 9, 10, with two copies of Shortcut, does not make a straight for us. What a shame. All right, then. In that case, we are still going to try and make Seance do things. In hearts. Oh, God. Cards drawn face down after each hand played. Well, I hate that.
I hate that a lot. <laughs> so this is eight, seven, six, five of hearts, four. And these two move. And this moves. So these are not the cards I want. Oh, I can discard to get stuff back. Okay. Nine, eight, seven, six or a five and a four makes a straight flush for seance. We get immolate. Destroy five random cards, gain $20. Standard pack. Choose one of... One of up to three cards... What, three playing cards? Interesting. Right, so we should sell a shortcut. It's not doing anything for us. Let's look at a standard pack. Six of hearts. Returns to hand when played. We are prefer preferentially taking hearts for everything, so we'll do that. We have zero money, so we'll go next round. Choose up to standard tag. Gives a free mega standard pack. Choose two of up to five playing cards to add to your deck. And we have a double tag, so that will go off twice. So we can add up to four cards to our deck. Create up to two common jokers must have room. God, so much stuff I don't recognize. All right, let's hold on to our double tag for a little longer. And is there ever a world where I can find some clubs before doing my hearts? Queen Jack 10, 9, 8. So we need an ace, a king, a 10, a 7, or a 6 of clubs. Yep, that's a straight flush. Love to see it. So that's going to give us another spectral card. Creates a random rare joker, sets money to zero. We have zero money, so yes, I will take it. Thank you. Oh, it's my beloved. Gains 0.5 malt per discarded jack this round. Currently times one malt. Hit the road. Love it. Love hit the road. Um, how many jacks do we have left in the deck? Two more. If I want to play these diamonds, I can't discard this jack. Really, I want to play some hearts. We still have 11 hearts in the deck. So there's a lot to be found out there. I have no discards. Okay. That's going to do me no favors then. And I definitely don't want to destroy this jack with Immolate. So I need to draw five hearts fast. I need to draw one heart fast. Thank goodness. So now we're on the hunt for every Jack in the history of the world. There's Gro Michel. Plus 15 malt, 1 in 8 chance this card is destroyed at the end of the round. Those numbers have changed a little bit since the last time we saw it. However, I don't have $5. I could sell Immolate for 2, but it's worth 20 to me if I can destroy some things. I don't really want to get rid of any of this stuff, so I have no other options than to just keep pressing forward. All face cards are drawn face down against the mark. So, I want to find my jacks. I also want my hearts. But I do also want to get rid of five cards. If I play this, it's going to come back to my hand. So, I'm going to discard these so I don't destroy them and hope to draw back any spades or clubs or diamonds. We got a six of hearts. So we can afford to lose this six of hearts if we do this. We didn't. Cool. 
Um, then I guess I'm just going to play Ace High and then draw back seven more cards. Okay, good. Now I want to find some jacks to get rid of. We still have all four of them in the deck. This is not a straight. We have two discards left, so I'd rather play hands to move through cards rather than playing discards to get through cards. Let's hold the ace and the heart. No, we'll hold the hearts, get rid of everything else. There's two jacks, but 9-10 jack king is very much the start of a straight flush. Am I flying far too close to the sun? Nope, this looks good. This is a straight flush territory. I can discard this. That's now up to two malt. I can't discard this one, unfortunately, but we can go Ace, King, Jack, 10, 9 for a straight flush in hearts with Seance. Add one gold seal to selected card in your hand and $3 when this card is played. We now have 32 bucks, which is great. There's the banana again. We've hit the road, that stands to be pretty good for us, just because I hydrate. Let's crack a standard pack. We could take any hearts, we could take any jacks. Jack of hearts. Pretty, pretty good. Raise the cap on interest earned. Well, we're not going to earn that much money anytime soon, I don't think. We have capped out our five slots for jokers. So we'll keep moving. Now nah, we'll get a celestial pack. Show me Neptune for straight flushes. All face cards are drawn face down. Okay. We could play the full house we have. This could be a king, a queen, or a jack. Let's stick talisman on something. If I play this five of hearts, I can't make a straight flush in hearts afterwards. Unless it... I guess with a four I could. Yeah. That'd be fine. Right, that was a jack. Love to see it. We have another full house if we want it. We would need 710 in hearts to get towards a straight flush. Or again, we are presented with full house territory. I want to save a discard in case we get a bunch of face cards back, so I'll play this one. Alright, we are nearly where we need to be in score. Do we have ace, deuce, four, five in diamonds? We have the deuce, we have the ace, we don't have a five or a six, so we can't do anything in diamonds. don't think we are magically going to be able to make a straight flush anytime soon, but we discard two more jacks. This will be at least 150 points. Banana is safe. We've got misprint and not discovered. 150 chips if played hand contains a straight. 
Overstock for the shop. Not discovered. Standard pack. Let's discover that. Wow. All the sixes. Purple seal creates a tarot card when discarded. Foil six of hearts. Foil six of hearts. Uh, six of spades with a blue seal returns to hand when played. I'll take the six of hearts. We have so many six of hearts already. Arcana pack. We can double our money, get two tarot or a steel card. Steel card's now 1.5 malt, 1.5 times malt when this card stays in hand. Give me the money. I will now take overstock since we have a bit of extra change. There's standard joker. Brainstorm is incredibly good. Copies the ability of the leftmost joker, much like blueprint copies the joker directly to your right this is just the joker that is in the far left spot what would i get rid of though it might be too late for seance to do incredible things for us if we're just going to focus on getting the win Gains plus two malt if hand contains a two pair. Diet Cola again and another not discovered. Right, I really want to use this double tag for something, especially now that we are much stronger up here. After defeating the boss bind, gain $15. Shop has a foil joker. Those aren't exciting. So we don't care about straight flushes as much anymore we do care about is finding jacks to discard put that there for this to copy while we're not playing jacks is ace high again we could play the straight but I'd rather just ditch the jack Another jack. And another jack. And now we have a straight flush anyway. We can have one that comes back to us or the extra foil. This is up to 2.5 molts. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to stick that in the far left. Play the straight flush. This will 2.5x the 12. Then we'll get Gross Michael... Lusty Joker, and then this will two and a half X everything after that. Forty six thousand. Not bad going. Fibonacci, a classic. This guy's still undiscovered. A mega buffoon pack. Choose two of up to four Joker cards. I mean, we'll unlock it, we got money. Misprint, Drunkard, Greedy Joker, Not Discovered. Drunkard is interesting because more discards means more hit the road. Do we really need Shortcut if we're not worrying about our straight flushes anymore? We're just playing regular flushes. I guess we have much more value in our straight flush than we do anything else right now. All right, I guess we're skipping. Arcana pack for four bucks. Uh, a hermit card, bonus chips, or a steel card. Let's take a steel king of diamonds. Foil jokers, I'm not that interested in. All club cards are debuffed coming up. So we're just going to play high card, look for jacks to discard, and hearts to hold on to. I will play this full house. If 
5,000. Just a pair, but I want to save my discards for the jacks. I'll hold the queen, play the deuce. All right, we did not find more jacks. We still did not find more jacks. That's upsetting. We are not going to be able to make a straight flush here, are we? Let's hope this is 3,000's worth. I think it should be. And I think we want this copying that because doubling 4 to 8 with hit the road is not very much. But doubling 20 to 40 is a lot. So we want that there because we want hit the road to double everything that we get out of those two. Yes, indeed. Make spades, Fibonacci, strength, buffoon. I'll take the buffoon pack I've not seen before. Drunkard and greedy again. No thanks. Jumbo Arcana. Sure thing. $7. Some malt. Planet cards, extra chips. Just give me Wheel of Fortune. First one of the new demo. Set us up for a good standard moving forward. Classic. Classic stuff. All clubs are debuffed. Shouldn't be a bother. Just going to turn over five cards by playing them. Then discard two jacks. Hold the king. I think we could probably just play a flush already. More jack swimming. Now, this is debuffed, so we won't get hit the road bonus. At least, I don't believe so. Correct. Another day, another flush. Alright, anti number five. Tarot cards appear two times more frequently in the shop. Don't need it. Jumbo Buffoon Pack. Not discovered. Four Jokers. Alright, it might be time to get rid of Shortcut. The Trio. Times two multiplier if played hand contains three of a kind. Not discovered. Not discovered and raise fist. 0.25 malt per consecutive hand played without playing your most played poker hand. So, we have played high card 13 times. So if we just never play high card again, or at least 6 times for full house and flush, we could get loads of value out of that. So, shortcut, you're out. Obelisk is in. Celestial pack. Give me straight value. Hold plus three cards in next round. Well, oh, shop has an uncommon joker. Give me plus three cards in next round. We get that twice. So when we play this now, we have 14 cards in hand. Oh, it's ludicrous and I love it. Okay. So we want to make obelisk as big as possible right we have played 13 high cards seven full houses seven flushes so i want to play like three of a kind two pair and straights that's what i want to do i think So 
so that gets a little bit bigger. Um, here. Is two pair. What do I want brainstorm copying right now? Is a great question. Maybe just obelisk? No, probably banana. I just don't want to win too fast because I want time for obelisk to get big, you know? Right, I think it's about time. We discard four jacks. But I just, I can't, my brain can't pass looking at 14 cards in hand. It's monstrous. Uh, we want to play anything except high card. Anything at all. We want to keep that king. We've played... Three straights, so this will be fine. This is at 1.5x, this is at 3x. I don't want to score too much too soon, is my problem. Let's do that. I want to use all of my hands making obelisk bigger. It was giant. It was absolutely huge. Okay. Death. So that two cards convert the left card into the right card. That means I can make another jack. Justice means I can make something into glass. Jumbo celestial pack. Uh, what is mediocre? Three of a kind. No. Two pair. Sure. Arcana pack. Permit for double money. A wild card. A stone card. Uh, let's make this into a stone card. Why not? Lose one dollar per card played. Fine. Oh, I don't have 14 cards in hand anymore. That's probably important. Okay, then. You go on the left, you copy that, and then you guys are on the right. This is not high card. It's 8,000 for a fairly standard hand. This is also not high card. And actually, let's discard the jacks. And the jacks. And... Yeah, I think this will just do. Pair of aces, we've played pair six times. Alright, up to anti six. And some delicious looking popcorn. We don't have money for anything, so off we go into the final round. Forces one card to always be selected. Yikes, I hope you have a few tricks up your sleeve for this final challenge. Alright, so my six of hearts is selected. It's going to come back to the hand when we play it. Uh, yeah, blue seal returns to hand when played. We could play two pair. That'll be fine. Seven thousand. Only forty thousand points needed. My brain thinks fifty thousand was the previous boss of this stage of proceedings. Full house. Yeah. Still far off playing. Um, 15 of any particular hand to overtake high card. This 5 wants to be played. I don't want to play high card. I could play a pair or I could discard stuff. Let's play the pair.
Then a jack, we can make a two of diamonds into a jack of clubs. Now they're both selected, and I cannot deselect them. Don't know if that is intentional or a bug. I will report that back to the developer, but we will find out. Um, this can all go. Art must be played. That's fine. We will play a pair like this. All right, we have one hand left. I want to see some jacks to discard. I'm not going to find them. I have to play this ace. Oh no, I discarded that ace, of course. Um, here's another jack. And if I make... Ah! Oh, enhances one card into glass. I can't make my nine into glass because I can't deselect this three. That's very sneaky game. Uh, still, four of a kind at base five is not bad. Um, if we three and a half X that, and then three and a half X it again after we get banana, and then we two and a half X it on the end, plus 1.5 X for king of diamonds, everything will be great. And thus, we have won our first game in the new demo, Good thing I didn't bet against you. Good thing too, my friend. All right, that is everything for now. As ever, if you want to check out anything, it's all linked down in the description. I'll see you guys in the next one. Lots more to come. Thanks for watching. Cheers.